a system of equations is through eliminate, elimination. So I really like this way, um, some, but we're not going to really stress it. We're really just, this is going to be just a quick little touch upon it and then go on. So you'll see this more in ninth grade when you take algebra. So with elimination, we can see right here that if we were trying to solve this algebraically and we're going to substitute, we would try to get y by itself or x by itself. But with elimination, we can pretend that this is an equation and we can add or subtract away. So when we look at this, what we look in and we see is can we combine these or subtract them in order to get rid of the x or the y? So if we cover up everything but the x's, if we add negative 4x plus 4x, will that get rid of the variable x? Negative 4x plus 4x would be 0, so yes, that would get rid of everything. So we're going to pretend that it is a equation. I'm going to add these two together. So negative 4x plus 4x is 0. Negative 2y plus 8y is 6y. And negative 12 plus negative 24 is negative 36. And there we have, we have figured out how to get rid of one of, our, one of our variables. So now we just need to solve for y. We can divide, this will cancel out, plus zero, it's gone. We can divide by six on both sides and get y is equal to negative six. And now we just need to pick one of the equations. Why don't we pick four x plus eight times y is equal to negative 24. And instead of y, we're going to substitute negative 6 in. All right, next part. Now we're going to 8 times 6 is 48, but 8 times negative 6 is negative 48 is equal to negative 24. And if we add 48 on both sides, we're going to get 24 is equal to 4x. Now if we divide by 4 on both sides, we get x is equal to 6. And so now we have our solution set of 6 comma negative 6. These two should connect at 6 comma negative 6. All right, now I would like you to solve number two.